Welcome back, everybody, to Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. I'm an old guy gaming, and we're going to pick up uh, where we left, left off in the last episode, uh, which I don't remember what we were doing. <laughs> it's been a while since I've actually played uh, the game here. I've uh, been doing a lot of uh, Seven Days to Die and, and Imperion, uh, which are kind of the main games that I play. Uh, but uh, let's get back to this. And, oh, what's that thing down there? A little gigantic uh, firefly. And, uh, yeah, continue on here in this episode. So, <clears throat> if I remember right, we're supposed to be going after, uh, we're supposed to, I think we're supposed to be, like, liberating, um, some Wookiee, Wookiee prisoners, uh, that the Empire has. Um, and I'm trying to remember, how, how did I even get to this point? I'm not really sure. Did we come this way? We probably came this way, would be my guess. Kind of looks looks familiar, I think. Did we come through here? Yeah, that that looks that looks familiar. I think didn't we? Did we come through there? Yeah, we came through here. I think. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> well, let's just let's just continue on, then, um, and uh, have some more fun with Star Wars. Okay, let's do this. Oh, don't don't go running off the edge of the cliff there, Mang. So let's see. I gotta get back into to the swing of things too here, literally and figuratively. So force push is that button. That's our dodge button. Okay. And then uh, I think isn't I thought number one key was our time slow. Okay, hold on. I gotta check. I gotta remember what that is, obviously. So let's go to settings and controls. Uh, edit controls. Okay. Navigation hollow map vehicle. Heal target interact. Um. Hmm. Very block force attack <laughs> is F and Y. Wait a minute. What? What is force attack? Exactly. Single blade. Oh, here we go. Okay, slow push and pull. So slow. Is, oh, slow is the middle button. Okay, yeah. So I so I, I change that to the middle button. Push is the upper thumb button, and then uh, pull currently is three. We don't have that mapped yet, or we haven't found it yet. Okay. But what is this? Uh, what is this force attack? It's the F key. Oh, oh, right, 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 right. <laughs> we almost jumped off the edge of the cliff. That's right, I remember that now. Okay, uh, so that's actually, that's actually, um, here, let's sit back down here for a second. It, <laughs> I haven't played this game in like two weeks, so I'm trying to get my head back in into it. Uh, so if we go to the skill tree, here we go. Okay, so yeah, force attack is all the stuff in, in this tree here. Um, so yeah, it's this one. Uh, this unlocks a powerful strike that's deadly against weaker enemies. Dash strike. That's what we did. Dash strike. You have to hold the F key down. Okay, and then this is after... Uh, attacking after a quick evade allows Cal to quickly perform a kick attack. Right, okay. I gotta remember all that stuff. So those are the three special moves that we currently have unlocked. Okay. I got this, man. I got this. I got this. Okay, so if we do a dodge and then an at attack, uh, it do he does a kick. Uh, if we just do F by itself, he kind of does a jump, and if we hold F down... No, uh, it we just have to tap F to do the overhead thing, and then holding F down is where he does the start forward thing and then kind of an uppercut type of thing okay i got this let's do this so that's got a thingamadoodle does that mean we push it sure enough sure enough okay cool all right we got some bad guys down there over there one of the cutters turned on are they running some kind of drill oh my goodness maybe think we should call it in Call it in. Yeah. Better do this by the book. 
Yeah, do it by the book, guys. Do it by the book. Okay, so we're also supposed to be able to force slow multiple groups of enemies. I think we do that by holding the slow key down. It doesn't look like we're going to get their attention. Can, can we push all the way? Oh, we can. Look at that. All right. So let's just let these guys kill themselves. Yeah, he's tougher than the other dudes. One more should do it. Oh, he hit us. Okay, so let's come down here. Were we supposed to climb that vine right there? Let's try that again. Yep, sure enough. Now, now what do we do? Do we climb, just climb up here? Hmm. Not, I'm not sure what we're supposed to do with this. It won't let me climb any higher than this. Whoa. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure what that's for. Maybe it'll... Oh, I bet you I was supposed to swing and then drop on top of their heads. That's probably what I was supposed to do. Okay. That's probably what I was supposed to do. Hey, it's a black R2. Attention all units. We've lost contact with our troops stationed at cargo pad 119 Grek. 119 Grek, huh? Okay, looks like we're going this way. That's a lot of dudes. All right, come at me, bro. Oh. Are they going to come at me, bro? Yeah. Are you a blaster guy or what kind of what kind of dude are you? We'll win easy. Don't lose sight of him. He moved. You can't beat us all. Get in here. Okay. We can catch him still. Oh! I tried to do it. I tried to do a uh, a force push on him. Yeah, we're out of force. Okay, we gotta get a parry in here. Ah, shit! Oh, they got me. <laughs> okay, we'll do, let's do this again. I'm I'm a little out of practice, but we'll get back we'll get back into it. We'll get back into it. Okay. We're gonna have to, oh man, we're gonna have to start back at the thing, my doodle too, huh? That's right. This is a checkpoint save game. Oh, <laughs> it didn't work so well, did it? <laughs> okay. That didn't work so well. We're supposed to blow this guy up. Oh, look at that. We blew him up. <laughs> I don't know if we were supposed to do that or not, but we did. All right, let's be let's be a little bit more tactful about uh, about doing this. I can take him myself. How can we stand You and me. Nice. Okay, let's see if we can parry this guy. Spot on. Well, we didn't parry him, but we killed him. Alright, so we had a guy come from around the corner last time. Two. Yeah, there he is right there. Okay. 
Um, let's go ahead and how are we gonna how are we gonna play this? One? You won't be routed. You oh. won't escape. You guys are dead what now. All right, you and me, bro. Let's try one of these. <laughs> okay. Ooh, that looks. That must be. That's just a vat of the of the stuff that they're um, harvesting, like the sap from the trees. Uh oh This can't be good. Can't this is what I prayed for. Staff Perch Trooper, capable of counterattacks after being parried, remain vigilant while briefly lowering their defense at the end of a combo attack. Oh, will briefly. Okay. Yeah, we kind of figured that out, actually. Kind of intuitively, I figured that out without thinking too hard about it. So wait for them to finish their combos and then attack. Hunters of the Imperial Inquisitorius, the Purge Troopers track survivors of the treasonous Jedi Order. Operating in the shadows, they scour the galaxy to assist Inquisitors in their sinister mission. This specialized class is skilled primarily with the Electro Staff, providing a lethal challenge to any lightsaber-wielding foe. Their ability and penchant for vengeance are displayed through a deadly combination of intuitive counterattacks and trained maneuvering. All right. Go! Vents are open. Oh, we go in here, do we? Ooh, it looks a little like it might be a little warm in here. Tight fit, huh, BD? I can't fight anymore! Flame beetles! They're coming through the wall! Flame beetles! Alright, let's let the flame beetles, uh... Spin these dudes out a little bit, maybe? Or maybe not. I don't know. <laughs> they spew uh, lava when they die. Okay, well, um... We, uh... We need to do this. No, not that. What's the... What's our healing key? Can't remember. We better look. We better look. Jump, evade, force attack, interact, interact, target, heal, uh, Q. Because, you know, heal and Q. Stim? That was close. There we go. Nice. All right, these guys are just blaster guys, so we should be able to let them kill themselves. Understood. Are you gonna... Are you gonna... Are you gonna... Are you gonna shoot me? Attack him, quickly! Yeah, quickly attack me. All right. Oh, we're out of force. That's not good. All right, here we go. Here, you're a coward. Oh shit! No, 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 no. We don't like fire. We don't like fire. Stand still. How about you stand still? I really need Dang. a stem. Yeah, I think we do need a stem. <laughs> shit. Oh, that's the that's the little saw thing. Oh, look at it. It's still cutting through. Oh, cool, man. I think we're gonna have to climb up on there, but let's, um... Oh, hold on, hold on. Do a scan there, BD. Flame Trooper. Uh, find paths that outmaneuver the trooper. Play, find paths that outmaneuver the trooper. 
Uh, flame rifle requires cooldown after use. Close the distance and strike. Okay, flamethrower. Uh, flame trooper is a specialized commando supporting the war machine of the Galactic Empire, highly proficient in the use of incendiary weapons. Their flame rifle has a range of roughly 10 meters, ca canvassing a wide but short range. Uh, through limited, oh, though limited in their agility, they make use of their weapon by restricting a target's freedom of mobility and forcing them into position. Although deadly, their flame rifle utilizes a combustible fuel source that requires time to cool down. Okay. I'm looking. We we probably can't come up here, to, can we? Okay. No, we gotta. All right, we gotta go. We gotta go. Wait, 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 wait. What's up here? Oh man, we gotta find this S comp link business. That's not a crate, is it? No. Okay. Yeah, I'd say the thing's a uh, kind of rough shape there, isn't it? Okay. You sure you want to plug into this thing? Okay, overcharge. Okay. Oh. I'm glad he did that because, <laughs> because he jumped off by himself. I didn't do it. I was going, am I supposed to stay on or jump off? Yeah, I think that thing's about done. I think it's about done for. But oh, it'll... A shortcut! That's why you wanted to move this thing. Of course. You yeah. had no idea that was there, did you? You just wanted to turn that cutter on. Okay. Oh, look at that save point. Woot! Very nice. Okay, let's rest. And we oh, we have two skill points. We have two skill points. So let's uh, take a look at that. All right. We got to figure out what we want to do. So let's look at the health stuff here. This. Yeah, we got to use this. Okay. What's that do? That gives us maximum life. That gives us Cal Automatic Deflect Splash of Bolts while he is sprinting or wall running. Hmm. Yeah, let's uh, let's just increase our life with this one. Okay, maximum life increased. Now, excuse me. Let's look over here. Increase the distance a cow can travel when using dash strike. That would be useful. What's this do? Attacking out of a sprint allows cow to perform a special lightsaber attack. And this is waiting longer to press attack after cow swings his light. Saber allows him to perform a special attack with increased range. Waiting longer to press attack after Cal swings. So when we attack, we pause, and then we attack again, I'm guessing, based upon what that's showing up there. Hmm, interesting. Now, view, yeah, let's like look at that. View ability. Okay, and I, I take it that the second attack can't be parried by an enemy, I guess. Okay, that could be useful. Okay, uh, what... Let's look at this one. Yeah, that's quite quite a leap, isn't it? Nice. Okay. Um, you know what this reminds me of is um, Fable 2. I never actually played Fable 3, but Fable 2 would show you the attacks when you were learning them, which was really cool. Um, increase the distance of Cal. Okay, so we looked at that. What's this one? Let's look at this one. View ability. He's sprinting, and then he does a, a whammy attack, which, again, I'm assuming can't be blocked, or at least probably not by normal enemies. Hmm, okay. Useful stuff. How about this one? Oh, yeah. That would be useful. Boom! An airborne attack that allows Cal to push away nearby enemies when he lands. Space and F. Okay, let's look at force stuff. So, Cal regains more force when he defeats an enemy and regains some force when he hits a blocking enemy. That would be useful. That's our. We've already got done all the rest of the force stuff. 
So yeah, let's let's just fill out the force tree, and then we're gonna probably. I kind of like the um, attacking out of a sprint. Yeah, I don't know. They're all seem they also need pretty good. Can I perform another powerful attack after an overhead slash? Oh, we didn't look at that one. Boom, and then wham! Oh, <laughs> that's kind of cool. <laughs> so that's a double tap on the F key. Boom and wham. Okay, cool. Well, let's um, let's go with this uh, this force key. So we'll get more force back from kills and blocks, and then we'll we'll probably we'll have to decide between which. All those attacks are pretty cool looking, actually. So we'll have to decide which ones we're gonna do. All right, very good. Let's uh. I don't remember if we rested or not, so let's just do it again, just to be on the safe side. It looks like we did. All right, here we go. Come on, get him. I was just looking to see if there's anything over here. Oh, they're fighting a, a spider bug dude. Oh, there's two spider bug dudes. Hmm. Wow, we gotta fight two of those guys? Damn, son. Alright. Well, here we go. Oh, I missed the special attack thing. Lightsaber material required dunium. All right, we got some dunium. Oh, he wants us to scan something. New uh, terrarium seed acquired. Grease can cook with these. Bonshear. Oh, cool. Okay. I'm glad uh, BD1 could find that because man, there's no way I would have known that was there. <laughs> okay, now. So what do we got here? We're gonna have to do a force slow on that thing in doodle to get over there from here. What do we got back here? Oh, why do I get the feeling like there's going to be more Spideys to fight? Oh, shit! Ah! Oh! <laughs> Oh man, oh man, I was not expecting that. BD1, stem. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, shit. Okay. Okay, I gotta focus. I have to kind of study his moves. Ah. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> I looked in that little. That little area that I kind of had a feeling like we uh, were walking into something like that. And sure enough, there sure are a lot of uh, of like little mini bosses or world bosses. Oh man, and he's making a start all the way over here too. We could probably just zerg through there without actually having to fight those guys again. Oh wow, they killed one of them, nice. The thing is, is who's the worst enemy though? You know what I mean? Whoops. <laughs> I'm sitting there watching. We'll win easy. Just kill him already. Okay. We couldn't afford for that to happen. Move up! 
All right, let's <laughs> let's start over. I'm not paying attention here. Okay, rest up. guy over there. Okay, here, let's just see if we can get through here without having to fight those guys. Okay, what's over here? Let's check this out. Oh, shit first. This must just be like an alternate way to get over here because it can't couldn't we also come along the wall there? I think we could or we could wall run, maybe. I don't know. Okay, well anyway, that's the way we're supposed to go. Um Let's go back here. Okay, well, let's try this again. I keep hitting the wrong button. I hit the F key at the wrong time there. Ah! Okay, okay. Oh, he's got like a an hourglass kind of idea there. Oh no, that was the wrong time to use that, darn it. Oh. Need a stem. Come on, come on, get out of the way, get out of the way. Okay. Whew. Okay. Albino Wyshock defeated. Beady, are you going to do a little scan on him? Oh, he's scanning that stuff. The Battle of Kashyyyk. Uh, remnants of the B1 battle... Uh, remnants of B1 battle droids who stormed Kashyyyk for the Separatists during the Clone Wars. During the battle, the Separatists were defeated, the Republic became the Empire, and the Clone Wars came to a bitter end. Yeah, those look like uh, battle droids, don't they? Hmm. All right. Well, let's go uh, see what this is all about. A synth echo. Maximum force Control increased. Base. Hot damn. Another breach down here. Some kind of webbing. Hey, who's that? All right, cool. So we just uh, we just got had our maximum force increase. Looks like there's something over there. Let's read this. Why shock attack? Imperial stormtroopers were dispatched to fend off incoming attacks from local wildlife. They encountered fiercer resistance than they were prepared for. Yes, I bet you they did. All right, what's this? Hey. So what was in there? New poncho material. Okay. What do we got in here? Oh, so this is like an alternative pathway 
to get in there. I wonder if we could have gotten the sin sucker without defeating the y, you know the albino y shock. Huh. Okay. It also allows us to come back here and save because we don't need to go do the y shock again now that we got the sense echo. So let's uh let's do that. I'm curious, I'm curious too if, um... Oh, how did that miss? Goodness gracious. Okay, what happens if we go through here now? I just want to see if the Y-Shock's back or not. My guess is he's not going to be back, but... He, she, it, whatever. What was that? Yeah, we could have come down here and got that without fighting him if we wanted to. I would have fought it anyways, but I was just curious. Okay. We must have got... Did we get shot once? Oh, I don't remember. No. Doesn't matter. Let's go. Yeah, we could have wall run over here, too, if we wanted to. All right. Let's go, y'all. explosives mm. no the, the barrels are putting the sap in okay all right well there's a thing up there that's probably our save point I see th that we wall run over there but then where do we go from that point oh maybe we're supposed to use the sap thing well here let's just go and see what happens Okay, we had the save point thing up above, but it doesn't look like we can get to it without... We'll, we'll probably come across it another way, I'm guessing. Still alive in there? So far. Almost to the prison. Good. Imperial distress calls are going out across the planet. If you don't get the prisoner soon... We can do this. I promise. Oh, you know what? That blue thing we saw over there is, is probably a, another sense echo. Hmm. All right, well, let's save. That's what I'm thinking. Okay. Well, actually, guys, we're out of time anyway, so um, we're just going to pick up right where we left off, just like we always do. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and in, if you did hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, all that good stuff. We'll see you in the next Jedi Fallen Order episode. Bye-bye.